Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is GIMP, uh, GNOME Image Manipulation Tool or Program. We're going to insert some more images here. I want to show you how to do that with um, a file opening as layers. We're going to open this one as a new layer. Open. You, you can't see the open key down there because I'm not recording the whole screen. So Shift T to scale and grab a corner. And I'm kind of eyeballing it. I know there's probably a more efficient way to do that, but um, let's see. And I hit move. I should be able to move this. And I am. And once I get it moved to where I would like it to be, then I shift T again and scale from the corner. And I probably should be paying attention to the size of these right here. But I haven't been. Uh, so you can see, I can let's see. Um, Right-click properties. These are all. These all should be new layers. File layer. Uh, let's see if I can view my layers. Don't know how to view my white layers. Windows. Nope. 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 Should be able to view my layers. Don't know how to view my layers. Mm, full screen shrink wrapped. Show grid. I don't know where my layers are. So we'll go ahead and import one more photo. Open as a layer. And there's the last one. Click open. And Let's uh, shift T again to scale. Ooh, and this one's huge. Um, let's see if I can get it to where I can actually see 300. Uh, okay, well, this didn't scale correctly, so we'll put it at 200. And let's see what it does. I have lost my angle, I lost my handles, so I'm going to cancel that, and control Z. Now that's a different problem, so why don't we file open that as a new, um, actually we'll create a new, file new, create a new, click OK, because that image is just way too large. It may actually have the same problem when I import it this time too. Um, open. Yeah, it's 304K. Click open. And now if I shift T. Let's see if it's going to work for me this time. Yeah, okay, much better. And height, width, etc. Click scale. Now it should all scale down nicely. There it goes. And control A, control C. Now let's see if I can scale and I'll see if I can paste this in. Control A. No, 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 no. Cancel. Control V to paste. worked but it pasted inside that. I don't want to paste inside that. Control Z. So Control Z again and let's create a, a new box. Hmm. Select none. That's still selected though. Select hmm, none selected. Why is it still giving me this? Oh okay so I'll create a new layer file create uh, control and new where is my new layer layer new layer can shift in click OK and shift T let's see if we can scale that so I can get my layer to behave properly that looks like it's gonna work it's not pretty 
that is going to work. And scale. There it is now. Let's go back and get our original image. Cancel. Control A, Control C, and now we can take it back here and Control V. And Control V. Shift T, scale. Okay, there she is. And we scale to fit into the image. Scale. Okay, it's not perfect, but you get the idea. And if you know better, please post. Um, I don't know why people are buying Photoshop. Okay, you're going to say well, people buy Photoshop because what you just did uh, takes a long time. But not everybody is going to pirate their copy of Photoshop, and not everybody can afford Photoshop. GIMP is free, and free is far better than spending money, especially if you're pirating. Thank you for your time, and uh, happy computing.